So I was old for my age in high school. Uh, when I turned 16, it was the start of my junior year, which kind of sucked because it meant I got my driver's license later than everybody. So finally a day came where I had my license and I was going to drive to school for the first time. Before then, I had just had uh, my teachers or you know my brother or whoever give me a ride in the morning, but now came my chance to, uh, to drive my dad's car, the family car, to class. And so I was pretty excited. My dad had a souped up Nissan Titan truck, chrome decals, big wheels, huge loud blaring speakers, so I was pretty psyched. So I drove it to class and everything was fine and the day went by and we got to the last class period which was a tennis class and we would drive down to the courts which were you know, not right next to the school, not really walking distance. And so me and my buddy Cody, we drive down there and you know, we park in the parking lot and important note, there was no one else in the parking lot when me and him parked. So it's just my truck, Cody's Mustang, we get out and you know, we go mess around with the tennis course for a while. And then, you know, so we finished up. We burned a lot of energy that day, so we were pretty hungry. And usually what we would do is um, we would go to Mima's after tennis class, which was a Mexican place um, in town. Really great breakfast tacos and lunch tacos. So we're walking off the courts, and me and Cody kind of look at each other. And we just start running, like we race towards our cars. And, you know, I got there first, but what happened was, you know, we got in the car and, you know, we were going to race over to Mima's. And I got in my car first. And so I decided to, with this huge Yui, to like get around in front of him, like we're both parked here and I throw my car, my truck in reverse and I'm flooring it though, because this is gravel parking lot, so my tires are spinning and everything. And I make this huge Yui, and all of a sudden, boom! I stopped, like, I had ran into something, and I'd never been in a wreck before or anything, but still, first instinct was that this was bad. So, I step out, I look behind me, and there's this Nissan Altima, black Nissan that I've just demolished. The front end is just destroyed, and I'm like, oh no, yeah, my dad is going to kill me, for sure. And, you know, I look over, and there's this lady standing on the edge of the parking lot. And, you know, because I looked around, like, oh, my gosh, did anybody see what I just did? And this lady standing on the edge of the parking lot with this, with this look on her face that's just, like, like, completely bewildered. And I knew right away that it was her car. It had to be. And so, you know, my heart drops, and she kind of walks over, and we start talking. Uh, yeah, it was bad. And it's kind of funny because... Circums circumspection relates to the story in that there wasn't any. Like, it was my first day, but I wasn't really apprehensive or careful. I was overconfident. And so that lack of circumspection probably caused me to get in a bad car wreck. But that wasn't even the worst part. The worst part was that standing next to her was this little girl, clearly her daughter. So she had been going to pick up her kid. So if I had been, you know, a little bit later, or they had already been in the car, I could have really hurt someone. And that was not a good feeling. Um, everything turned out to be fine. You know, I got made fun of. Like, it was super embarrassing. But, you know, her car was all right. And, I mean, it wasn't, but they replaced it. And everything turned out okay. But that's what happened the first day I drove my car to school.